considering there is a national research, of course. Methods are defined by Brown as a generalized set of classroom specifications for accomplishing linguistic objectives. We need to know what methods are in order to perform different lesson plans to intervene the reality we are observing. Also, uh, strategies, which come Kumara Di Belu in 2008, in 2008 define, as the concept, define the concept as a useful tool for the teacher to develop student skills. We need different strategies. In this case, we're going to use social network, an authentic material that the students are actually uh, familiar with because they use it in their daily life, so it's a topic of interest for them. And finally, uh, techniques. Techniques are the different activities and tasks we're going to apply to the students to make them communicate inside the classroom. Using social network as a strategy and the techniques which are, uh, as Hammer said, correlated methods, correlated concepts between the method, techniques and strategies. We're going to make a specific activities and tasks to, for the students to perform and communicate with their peers. For the process, we created a methodological framework. It is important to mention that this is an action research and it possesses a socio-critical paradigm because we don't want just to observe and understand the reality, but we want to intervene the reality in order to transform it and make a positive impact. In this case, improve the students' willingness to communicate. Also, this study is going to possess a mixed approach. That is to say that it has a qualitative and quantitative uh, approach uh, regarding the materials we're going to use to understand the students' uh, reality and their preferences regarding social networks because we cannot use any social network. We need to know which are the social networks the students use the most, which is going to be analyzed in a quantitative process. But also their perception after the uh, interventions are going to be performed, so they are going to be analyzed in a qualitative process. Uh, this uh, study, as I said before, is an action research. We define uh, action research based on what Anne Byrne said in 2010. That is to say that it's a method of investigation where we are able to intervene a reality and transform it in, as, as well. This has a procedure. Anne Burns uh, promoted four different steps. Planning, action, observation, and reflection. We are, based, we are basing our uh, process in the, those four stages. First, in planning, uh, Anne Burns defines it as the planning stage, as the stage where you detect the phenomenon. In this stage, we are planning to uh, observe the students, uh, identify what are the main social networks they use through a survey, and uh, make different lesson plans and activities using different materials, and uh, creating, a, a finally, an interview and a focus group for the understand the students' perception. Then in the action plan, which is the uh, stage that Anne Burns says, as where you apply everything you planned before, we are going to actually perform the different intervention in a three weeks process. Uh, these intervention are going to be classes. Three different English classes applying the methodologies and strategies we are uh, promoting. Social networks and uh, making students communicate, talk to each other. Then in the observation stage is where Aaron Byrne says you have to analyze all the results. In this stage we are going to uh, <coughs> make the, actual, the, the real analysis of the materials we have gathered and the data we have gathered, like the survey, the interview, and the different observation records during the intervention process. So finally, in reflection stage, reflect upon the results, get conclusions, and, and see if the objectives and, answer and research question was answered. Uh, then, as I said before, we're going to need different materials and different data analysis techniques. Uh, in this case, the recent materials are observation records that are, gonna be part, are going to be part of the intervention process. The survey to understand what are the social networks the students are, going, uh, using them, are using the most. The lesson plans and extra material to perform the different intervention and intervene the reality. And the final interview, that is the focus group to gather the students' perception of what they've been living the last three weeks in comparison with what it was before. And the data analysis thing that we're going to use is open coding, categorizing, and triangulation of information. It's important to mention that these three steps are only for the interview, that is qualitative. 
because we want to gather the perception of the students and through an open coding we're going to be able to categorize and finally triangulate the information to gather some results and conclusions. And the survey is going to be analyzed through a quantitative method, as I said before, through charts uh, and pie, uh, pie graphs. <coughs> Finally, the expected outcomes, as I said before, the results we want to gather is that the students are going to be able to use the language, not only inside the classroom, but outside the classroom as well in their daily life. So they're going to be able to use social networks to communicate with others, not only in their uh, first language, but also in the target language. It is important to mention the contribution of this uh, proposal because there are no studies in the area here in this context that we are immersed. For example, uh, there are uh, studies about how to improve willingness to communicate with students, but not in private schools, not in Spanish-speaking countries. Most of them are in Japanese countries, Asian countries, or uh, in English-speaking countries. Finally, uh, also we found some limitation, of course, with the study, that we can't generalize the results because we are uh, performing these proposal and this research in a specific context, which is a private school. But if the study is going to be performed, for example, in a subsidized <coughs> school, we're going to uh, have to adapt some materials or some strategies to perform it. Thank you. Thank you very much. Good timing.